State lawmakers are trying to harden Texas against threats from foreign adversaries. Think about things like the Texas power grid, our water systems, ports, and military bases. Fox News Alex Boyer following a hearing today on Texas homeland security. Alex. Hey guys, you know, securing the southern border may be top of mind for many Texans, but experts who testified today before the committee say that they're really especially concerned about foreign threats from North Korea, Russia, Iran, and China. Now, this morning, members of the Select Committee on Securing Texas from Hostile Foreign Organizations held a hearing at the state capitol in Austin. The group is tasked with studying the possible threats foreign governments and organizations could have on Texas's economy, security, and values. Expert testified that China is responsible for the massive influx of deadly fentanyl making its way to the state. They also talked about the need for protecting the state's critical infrastructure, like our drinking water and gas supply, among others. I think it's absolutely essential from an overarching standpoint that Texas protect its critical infrastructure. And then within that, their priorities include uh, Protecting uh, uh, cyber infrastructure, as has been talked to about already, um, protecting uh, military installations and other critical infrastructure from Chinese entities uh, setting up shop in close proximity to them. But most especially in terms of critical infrastructure, protecting your water systems and your grid. The experts pointed to the massive global technology breakdown that occurred last Friday when a faulty Windows update was pushed out to users, grounded thousands of flights, as we know, closed government buildings, and crippled hospitals. And that, the experts say, was unintentional. They say that example illustrates just how fragile our economy is. Now, the committee will take those recommendations that they heard from experts today, uh, as well as looking at other things for drafting legislation for the next session that could help protect, again, the state's critical infrastructure, uh, which would be in addition to whatever the federal government continues to do.